If you're looking for music to buy or retro games and books, Baltimore has no shortage of record and music shops with several a short distance from your hotel. Up first, we have the Soundgarden Baltimore. Located in the Fells Point neighborhood and probably the most frequented, this local staple has a huge selection of new and used CDs and vinyl. They recently opened an attached Luna Garden Cafe with the folks from another record store, Babies on Fire, so you can grab a coffee or a bite as well. Also located in the Fells Point neighborhood, we have El Supremo Records. A few blocks further east from Soundgarden, El Supremo Records is a certified vinyl lover's paradise. A smaller shop in the basement for extra coziness, shop owner Jack Moore is very knowledgeable and has a fantastic collection in every nook and cranny. Just ask and he will help you find weird and wild music for almost any genre you need. Protean Books and Records, located in the Federal Hill neighborhood, is chock full of retro style video games, toys, clothing, movies, books, and tons of music. The store is also host to the Crypt of Curiosities, an attraction full of odd taxidermy, creepy, and weird objects that are mostly meant to be a bit goofy. Last on this very incomplete list, we have the True Vine, located just up Charles Street, not far from where you are. True Vine has a reputation for an incredible eclectic mix of global and experimental music, hosting intimate live shows, and is definitely worth checking out while you're here. If you have time to explore further, we highly recommend a trip to the Hamden neighborhood to check out Celebrated Summer Records with a great selection of music, but a truly amazing and fantastic collection of underground and punk flyers, posters, and zines. A few blocks from there, you'll find Strawberry Fields, which is real digging. A massive and inexpensive collection of constantly changing records priced cheaply. Normal's Books and Records in Waverly is also excellent. We could go on, but you're only here for three days and you're supposed to be in sessions, so let me show you the places where you can go see live music at night.